start with the pledge and then I have some things to say and then we'll get going. So if everybody would stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation. I'm just going to read some things into the record and then we'll get started. On April 2nd, 2024, the unofficial election results for Alderperson District 10 gave Marcia Reinhaler total votes of 407 and Joseph Heideman total votes of 411. After the Board of Canvassers met on Friday, April 5th, the result remained the same. We are here today to recount the ballots for District 10, which includes wards 19 and 20. Um, the meeting is being taped. If the microphones are on the ceiling so that we can have a transcript of the proceedings. And the board would ask that the side discussions happen outside the room because the microphones pick up everything. So uh, we wanna just make sure that the people are speaking are heard. There are five situations where each party uh, to a recount are given the opportunity to object. And I'm going to go through some of those now. Are there any objections to the recount itself? Okay. The board of canvassers is comprised of myself. I'm the city clerk, Meredith De Bruin, Martha Lepinen, and Chris Williams, who are both our election chief inspectors at different polls. Are there any objections to that composition? <laughs> Notice was provided via the um, to the public via e email and posting at 12.05 on April 9th. Notice was also provided to each candidate and the Board of Canvases on the 9th. The Board of Canvases, Canvassers has decided to perform a hand count of the ballots. And are there any objections to any of that? Okay. All right, so we are going to begin with 19 and end with 20. We have a checklist which we will follow. And we will try to explain as we go through, through things and please speak up if you have any objections. So we're gonna start with 19 for District 10. The total vote in District 10, or dis, Ward 19, District 10, the total vote was 325. The number of voters from the poll list was 325. The number of absentee ballots cast was 110 and rejected um, absentee ballots was zero. So the first thing we're going to do is reconcile the poll list. Yes. Do you have any objection to me sliding over to the other end of the table so you can see? It just feels wrong. Yep. 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 No, that's fine. Okay. Okay. Yep. I would just have you just yeah sit back a little bit, but yeah, not it doesn't have to be. Is it going to be up on the screen? Is that right? No, it's not. Oh, okay. I mean, if you want to look at them going through the poll books, you sure. certainly may come up here. Who's ever can do that? Mm -hmm. um, we'll start with A through L. Um, basically, we're just going to go through and make sure that the same voters were marked in each book. The first page of the <clears throat> let's just make sure that the first page was filled in correctly. So, Chris, could you say what A through L was? 170 voters. M through Z? 155 voters. Total of? 325 voters. And, okay, we had two, the page numbers are marked for A through L for the last voter. A through L, last is six. And M through Z? 62. And how many absentees? 110. So, if we could start uh, with A's. We are going to read off the line of the voter and then the sticker number that was given and if they were absentee or not. So oh, if they're absentee. Or not. Well, you just do like, um, so this is line three has a sticker number of 121. Mm -hmm. Line four is 2A. And oh, then you just, okay. yep, and then switch. Okay, line three is 121. Line four is 2A. Line one is 58. Line three is 123. Line five, 3A. And line six, 4A. 
Moving on to B's. Line four is nine. Line five is 57. Line 10 is 103. Line two is 5A. Line three is 6A. Line six is 73A. Line seven is 72. Line eight is one. Line 10 is 122. Line one is seven. Line four is 153. Line five is 70. Line seven is 132. And line eight is 84. Back to line one, it's seven, eight. I'm sorry, yes, it okay. is seven, eight. Line six is 66. And line nine is 8A. Line two is 56. Line four is 10. Line 10A, sorry. Line five is 11A. Line nine is 12A. And line 10 is 164. Line one is 163, line two is 13A, and line three is 71. Line one is 14A, line two is 15A, line nine is 130, line 10 is 131. <laughs> Line one is 137. Line two is 129. Line one is 87. Line two is 77. Line eight, 134. And the D's. Um, line one, 124A. Line one, 125A. Line four, 69. Line five, 68. <coughs> line seven, 17A. Line eight, 18A. Line nine, 19A. Line 10, 159. Line one, 160, line seven, 91. In the E's. Line four, 150, line five, 76, line six, 143, line seven, 142, line 10, 20 A. Line one, 21 A, Line three, 107 in the Fs. Line three, 140. Line four, 102. Line seven, 22A. Line eight, 23A. Line nine, 118. Line one, 126A. Line six, 158. Line seven, 24A. Line 9, 25A. Line 10, 26A. Line 1, 116. Line 5, 60. Line 6, 104. Line 7, 105. Line 8, 135. Line 6, 27A. Line 7, 28A. Line eight, 149. Line two, 29A. Line seven, 115. 
line 7, 88, line 1, 109, line 2, 154, line 6, 127A, line 10, 144, line 1, 145, line 1, 30A, line 8, 61, line 3, 156, line 4, 97, line 5, 89, line 6, 157, line, line 7, 155. H. Line 6, 67, line 7, 141, line 1, 65, line 4, 31A, line 6, 170, line 8, 78, line 9, 98. Line 2, 161, line 3, 162. <clears throat> line 5, 93, line 6, 92, line 7, 90. Line 6, 117, line 9, 119, line 10, 120. Line 6, 75, line 8, 32A, line 9, 81, line 10, 80. Line 2, 74, line 4, 33A, line 5, 34A, line 6, 59. Line 2, 147, line 3, 128, line 4, 151, line 5, 152, line 7, 86. Line 1, 35A, line 2, 36A, line 3, 37A, line 5, 138, line 6, 82, line 7, 139, line 9, 38A, line 10, 39A. Going on to I, line 185. And then J, line 540A, line 1, 100, line 2, 99. Line 3, 41A. Line 7, 42A. Letter K. Line 2, 43A. Line 3, 44A. Mm -hmm. Line 4, 101. Line 8, 108. Uh, line 9, 136. Line 3, 45A, line 4, 83. Line 6, 148, line 7, 47A, line 10, 165. Line 1, 167, line 2, 166, and line 3, 168. Line 3, 95, line 4, 94, line 7, 48A. Line 1, 49A, uh, line 4, 50A, line 6, 62. And line 1 is 112. Letter L, line 6, 51A, line 8, 52A, line 9, 53A. Line 2, 114, line 3, 113. 
line 1, 54A, line 2, 55A, and line 10, 133. Line 3, 96, line 9, 110, and line 10, 111. Line 2, 79. On to the supplemental. Line 1, 46A. And the... <clears throat> for the supplemental. Oh, for the supplemental. Mm -hmm. For this one. For, do, yep. they, do, yep. the names? do the names, because there's not line numbers. Okay. For um, Mary Abrashinsky, Number 16, Phyllis Blado, 63, Joel Bach, 64, uh, Jerome Kolar Dornick, 106, Brenda Gephardt, 146, and Chad Call, 169. I guess I have a question. Yes. What if there was a discrepancy? What would be the process? Well, then we would deal with whatever the discrepancy is at that point. There could be multiple things, so we will if there, we'll address it when it comes up. All right. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, what's the difference between the supplemental and the local? The supplemental are the people that registered on election day. Oh, okay. There's one supplemental where people registered late, which is the 20 days before the election, and then there's a, another supplemental of people that registered on election day. Mm, okay. So their names aren't printed in the poll book. Okay. <clears throat> Are you two still good with reading, or do you want me to read some? No. So, okay. okay. All right. Can we talk about the total number? Of oh, no, because we did that. Okay. They were all added on the eighth. Okay. Right. So I'll okay. double check. All right. So, yeah. Line 1, 107, line 5, 155, line 6, 8A, line 9, 9A, line 7, 110, line 8, 115A, line 10, 113, line 8, 1, line 2, 10A, line 438, line 689, line 963, line 10, 5. <laughs> line 1, 6, line 8, 10, I'm sorry, 11A. Line 1, 140, line 3, 137, line 5, 139. Line 1, 12A, line 796, Line 881. Line 1, 91. Line 2, 90. Line 3, 122. Line 4, 102. Line 10, 145. Line 2, 61. Line 3, 153. Line 2, 13A. Ends. Line 6, 98. <laughs> line 1, 14A. Line 2, 64. Line 5, 95. Line 6, 94. Line 7, 116A. Line 8, 58. Line 9, 15A. Line 1, 67. Line 2, 68. Line 6, 127. Line 7, 126. Hold. Line 7, 16A. P. Line 1, 66. Line 2, 65. Line 4, 51. Line 1, 17A. Line 2, 18A. Line 2, 7. Line 5, 19A. Line 9, 130. Line 10, 69. Line 1, 20A. Line 6, 21A. 
line 422A, line 523A. Q, R. Line 3, 129, line 4, 135, line 10, 117A. Line 1, 118A. Line 2, 134, line 5, 479, line 525, line 9, 119A, line 10, 24A. Line 175, line 276, line 377, line 9104. Line 2, 128, line 8, 141, line 10, 149. Line 1, 26A, <clears throat> line 3, 27A, line 4, 28A. Line 7, 103. Line 172, line 3, 100. Line 4, 101. Line 7, 125. Henry, can we stop for me? You bet. No. Okay. Okay. This name. Oh, it's signed in this book. Oh, it was actually so, signed. Okay. So let's just talk about that. Sure. Yeah. What page is this, please? Um, yes. 91. Anna Romero. Yes. Yep. And what line number? Line seven. Okay, thank you. Yeah, signed wrong book, 103, Anna Romero. Yep. Yep. That's okay. who it is. It's in the inspector statement. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Any objections? Okay. Um, a voter signed the wrong book. Oh, okay. And we have a uh, question two. Uh, when you're ready. Okay. When you say when you say a voter signed the wrong book, does that change the number total no. number? No, the sticker is in both books. The so voter just signed. Still in Ward 19. Still in Ward 19. Yep. Through Z. Yep. Letter R. Yep. Just signed the wrong book. You said this one over. You bet. Sure. Um, line 172. Line three. 100, line 4, 101, line 7, 125. S. Line 1, 97, line 3, 78, line 6, 29A. Line 7, 121A, line 9, 131. Line 1, 31A, line 6, 32A, line 7, 33A, line 10, 71. Line 1, 88, line 3, 87. Line 4, 146. Line 2, 124. Line 3, 3. Line 5, 2. Line 9, 34A. Line 10, 35A. Line 6, 36A. Line 7, 37A. Line 8, 144. T's. Line 4, 80. Line 7, 138. Line 8, 154. Line 10, Four. Line two eighty three, line three eighty two, line seven one oh five. Line five thirty nine A, line six forty A, line seven forty one A, line eight forty two A. You Line 7, 133, line 8, 132. V. Line 3, 73, line 4, 74. Line 6, 43A. Line 2, 44A. Line 10, 
one fourteen W line four one fifty line five forty five A line six ninety three line nine one oh eight line ten one oh nine line four fifty nine line five sixty two line seven seventy line nine forty six a line ten forty seven a line two one forty eight line four one twenty eight there's my name is it good go back line two one forty eight it's on the wrong line in here. On the wrong line. Okay. So we're on page 116. <laughs> and we have a sticker that's in the wrong book, or not in the wrong book, on different pages of the book. Okay. So we have 148A, and it looks like it's a Nancy line that signed the book. And then and has her sticker on there, on line three. So in this book, it's on line two. And that is a Jamie Weiner, which yes. is a totally different name. So are we comfortable that it was Nancy that voted on 148? Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you get that? Line three, Nancy, should be voter number 148 in the city book. Okay. I'll leave the sticky note there all right and then four yeah. is one okay. twenty one second yeah, one's yes correct. and the other person number two didn't vote didn't vote didn't vote and that's so if you the other book. did you want to come up and look is it would that make it easier on what happened oh, if, that'd you be see, great. yeah that's fine mind. if you want to yeah. come see sure. come around yep So we have two people that work the poll book. Was, and she just, just didn't, that person just didn't sign in at all. Okay, right. that's and persuasive. She wasn't there. Right. Okay. Good to move on. Did you have another question? I, I did. I'm sorry, go ahead. Um, we noticed there were numbers uh, ending in A for more than 110 absentee votes count. Wondered what the explanation was. Um, there was 115A, 121A. So those are the number um, that is given to that voter at that time for that ballot. So there are 325 voters. That voter's number for that absentee ballot was given 150A. Do you know what I'm saying? That's the line in which they got that absentee sticker assigned to them. And that doesn't mean there was 150 absentee ballots, there's 110 total. If we would count up, which we'll do next, count up all the A's, there'll be 110 A's in the book. But when they got to processing that one absentee ballot, that happened that that sticker number was 150. The so stickers is confusing. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. yes. Good question though, mm -hmm. yes. Okay, page 116. 116. Um, That's one we just did. We did it, okay, thank you. 117. Um, line 548A, line 7, 136. Line 149A, line 250A, line 8, 52A, line 10, 53A. Line 154A, line 255A, line 499, line 8, 106. X's. Line. Line 185. <clears throat> line 1056A. Line 292. Line 3151. Line 4123. Z. Line 2143. Line 3142. Line 9, 112, line 10, 111, line 2, 30, line 3, 57A, 
line 460. Now we're up to the supplementals. Jeffrey Schultz, 84. Stephanie Tendall, 86. Maria Smith, 147. Carol Norse, 152. I will step on it. I'll just start over again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fifty-three and fifty-seven is one ten, and that's what's in the front. And who had which? Which was fifty-three? Seven. Fifty-seven was M through Z. Thank you. All right. So then we need to check if there's any rejected absentee ballots. That should be in one two. None. Okay. Thank you. Now 
Now these are kind of sticky. So I, I took your finger. Okay. <laughs> Lost my finger. So these are in alphabetical order. So I'm trying not to mess them out of order, but if you can okay. count very carefully um, to make sure that we, what you have. Sixty-two. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That equals one hundred and ten. So we got one hundred and ten envelopes. One hundred and ten absentees in the book. So now we're just going to go through and make sure their certificates are good. So this is where if somebody wants to view as well, they can come up to the table and view as we go through. Can everybody see? Do you want me to sit? In, let me sit this here. So we can pull the chair. Yeah. You want to pull the chair? <laughs> That's fine. What's ever easiest to see because. We all have to see. So we're just going to look at them and then we're going to flip. So we're looking for voter signature, witness signature, witness printed name, and um, address. So if you stop me, if you don't agree or if I'm going too fast. Can you see? Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry. No, it's all good.
of the Israeli yeah. Associated or something, or he signed in that spot, not, not that spot. Yeah, yeah. and then signed where he should not. Together. There's a stamp. These are stamps. So these are people that voted in our office. Oh, okay. So instead of me signing them all, we just have a stamp. Page What's that? that? Makes, yes. Yeah. Those are people that voted in <clears throat> absentee. And uh, yes. so most, some of these have a stamp, but some of them not. Yeah, they don't have to be. And if they were voted in person, we wouldn't stamp them. For the date? Yes. Okay. So some of them that, like all of them that have my stamp, don't have a date stamp because they were here. So this was one we sent back to the voter to take her ballot out of this envelope and put in a different envelope. She sent everything back with it. She could have destroyed this, but she sent everything back. And what was wrong with it? I'm not even sure what was wrong with this one. Do you remember, Jess? Doris Schultz. She didn't have Sheboygan, I think. No, she would have had Sheboygan. She did not. There was no, there was not a city. As you can see, this is a different okay. than everything. Uh, so she might have written it on here, stuck it in there, and did this because it needs the Sheboygan. What, what number four? I'm sorry, if this was Doris Schultz. She was voter number 121. I guess we'd rather have more than less. We just sent it all back. That's right. Good. I'm going to keep you there. Okay. Because I think the next thing, the checklist here. All right. Count envelopes and compare. Inspector statement says 110 is one. All right. So now we're going to get to the ballots. We need an inspector statement. Chris, can you fill in that inspector statement? We're going to verify the seal on the ballots. So the seal is written in two different places. It's written okay. down here and it's written on the 101. Okay. So the seal number is 2082337. 2082337. And these were documented on election night. Same seal. Now we're gonna break it. Should have had scissors. I'm sorry. Oh, sad. <laughs> Ripped my finger. That Is that the new one? The I'm new sorry. One? Yeah, this one just broke. All right, so we'll just keep this paperwork up here. 
So the first thing we're going to do is count the ballots to make sure there's 325 in here. Because that's what it should be. We've got some tapes. Three ballots in there. All right, so I don't know if you want to use your fingers and put them in stacks of 25. Sure. So that we can all count some. Over there. There it is. Thank you.
when you uh, CSR 25. So these are 75. This is why the machine code works well. So 13, so 130. Yeah, and then I've got six. So there's got to be an extra one somewhere in something that I have. It should be 325. like that because they stick together. Thank you. These two will stick together. The other thing, if you could start, Chris, coming over here and making sure there's not a 20 in here. Okay. So at the end of the night, all the 19s and 20s go into one bin and they have to separate them. So my thought is there might be a 20 in here somewhere too. What is the count that you're getting? Um, I think it was 326. You're done counting and looking at new stats and some of that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 
100, 100 in this group right here. Number three thirty one three thirty one. Okay, three thirty two. Should be three twenty five. Hello. I guess we keep going and split and see what we got. There's 331 Ward 19 ballots that we've counted, and the tape says we have 325. Okay. Yeah. Can I ask a couple of questions? Maybe. <laughs> what you got? Well, if the tape on, uh, you know, ends at 320 on, on the night of the election, mm -hmm. shows 325. Mm -hmm. Um, the how do we end up with 331? How is it possible to end up with six more ballots if those have been, been confined, locked, etc.? Machine didn't read them. Who didn't read them? Machine didn't. That's. I mean, to me, I'm not making guesses now, but I don't know. That's why we keep going and see if we find something along the way. At this point, I don't know how you end up with 331. Unless we didn't count right, but we counted three times. And it would be off by six. Are these the oldie moldy machines that you're following? No, these are, no, these are um, brand new. Ah, I'm sorry. Yeah. Brand new. Brand new. Unless we counted wrong, but let's just keep going. Let's see if we find the FCs, the 110 that we are supposed to, okay, and then we'll go from there. So the first thing we want to do is sort these by initials, see how many absentee ballots we have. So if we all want to come, just the three of us here, and just we're going to sort absentee. Unless they're sticking together, which they could stick together too. Maybe we count it wrong. We'll keep going. Thank you. 
That was 45. Thank you. 46.
So now it's 220. So we were 10 off. But thank you. <laughs> okay. So this is better because can you go get the ballots for? So right now we have 10 the other way. It's not 231, it's 221. 321, sorry, right? 50, 50, 50, 50, 300, or 200, 310, and 11. So that's 321, which is better because if we have the ballots for 20, 19, there might be four 19s and 20. Okay. Okay. Should we put these? Nope, we're going to leave these out. Okay. We're going to look into 20 and see if we have those four. <clears throat> uh, previously, did you guys double count the stack of 10? It must have been. Okay. So what does it break down in terms of uh, absentee versus? Uh, we have 110 absentees. So that's the number we should have gotten. That's the number we counted of the envelope. That's the number that we had on the inspector statement. That's everything. So now you're saying you have two. 321. So we're four short, which is probably, if I had to make a guess, in 20 bang. Do we have the inspector statement for 20 as well? We're going to compare the seals before we break this down. Much better. What? How exciting. Oh. <laughs> Exciting is a good word there, Chris. It's like, it's secure. All right. All right. So, all right, 20 has two bags. And we have two seals. One is 218-2338. Can, re can you repeat that one more time? 218-2338 and 218-2340. Are we good with that? Yep. All right. So all I'm, we're not going to count. We're just going to go through and look for 19s. Okay. okay. <clears throat> All right. So I'm going to have you kind of work down here if you don't mind away from the ballots. There you go. Thank you. 
There's two, three. Another one, there's four. Keep going through just to make sure. Yummy. All right, so we're going to put them back in the bags. All right, you can put them in one bag, actually. We have an extra seal, Jess. I'm just going to seal them until we get to this one. So we know they're sealed. Thank you. All right. And if you just want a document in the minutes, then what the seal number is. And I'll read that yep. to me. 208-2321. All right. So those were all ballots that were not absentee. Yes. Could you just have a generic clarification as to how that occurs on the end of election night for everybody? So at the end of the night, election inspectors have to look at these itty bitty numbers at the bottom after a 16 hour day and separate them into their wards. Um, this has actually worked out good because both 19 and 20 were at the same location. If we had 19 at a different location, we'd have to go get those ballot bags to go through there. It, I mean, it happens. They're just random in there, and it's hard to see those little numbers when you've been working that long. So um, it's just a procedural thing. It doesn't mean that the ballots didn't go through the machine. It doesn't mean they didn't get counted in some way. They just ended up in the wrong bag at the end of the night. So you did find four? Yes, we found four. So we're now we're up to 324, where we should be. All right, so now, Jess, do you have those um, so we can separate them by person? Okay, so now absentee doesn't matter because we have declared that we have what we should have. So I don't know if you want a representative. We're going to go through the ballots now and separate them by candidate. So anybody that wants to, well, not anybody, I would say representatives. 
don't want to. Thank you. All right. So we're doing a stack. And then we will do we'll do the extra ones later. We'll just kind of have a stack of random at the end. All right. Are we ready? Marsha. Can we okay. oh, yeah. show us where the okay. is? I'm sorry, right here. Okay. All right. So this is what we're looking for in putting them aside. Yes. I thought we were looking for the same spot. Yep, same yeah. spot on every ballot. You're welcome. Yeah. yeah, please speak up at that time if you, as we're going through, and we can put things aside and then deal with them after. That's a no vote, yeah. We'll go through those at the end as well, but anything that we don't. through those again, but just so everybody can see. That's okay. Okay, that was not okay. In there, sir. Right. You did a good job going in the circle.
one is some other way. Yeah. Yep. Yep. That was for the judge. <laughs> Sorry, no, that's all right. Just for a minute. There's a whole bunch of circles. <laughs> they start to like. Yeah. I start moving around a little bit.
wrong way. That we're probably registering for your sign. Yeah. Okay. Once we count them, if you want to pull any aside, you can pull any aside, and then we can, once we count, if there's something, you know what I mean? If there's something that you. What's interesting, what was interesting the last time I did this was how well the machines picked up, mm -hmm. even marks like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what black and blue. Yeah. Oh, yeah. if anybody else would like to see that and if you show that. Yeah, was it the second one? Yeah, it was the like sand one. Yeah. Right. There are some, oh, yeah. even like a test mark or something. That, yeah. Yeah. For this one, you mean it's even yeah. smaller. Mm -hmm. Yep. If you want to pull it aside. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, just in case. Yep. Yeah. Yep. yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Because that's persuasive. If sure. That shows up on the towel. You mean as far as this race goes? Yeah, it's not a race. Right. Yeah, that's not yeah, going to yeah. come out. Yeah, we sure. won't be counting sure. that one for that race. All right. So what I'll have you do, I think, yes. Yeah, but that's for the judge. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, that, there you go. Yeah. You're in the wrong spot. All right. Good. So I think it would be pens. We we'll do okay. tabs. Yeah. Stacks of 10. Mm -hmm. And then um, so if you wanted to spread them, there's stacks of 10, however you want to do them. But then we'll switch okay. and, and we count? count each other's. Yeah. Thank you. 
it's a bigger weight. Put a note on top of it or? Um, yes, but well, or just leave it off to this, like, like look, put this one up here for a second. Okay. All right, so now we're going to switch. All right. And maybe start at a corner and go across so you know which ones you've counted. Let's make sure you have stacks of 10. That's right. So we'll just count it back in. It's just I got it under control.
All right, so I'll have you both sit. I'm going to have you tally as I count them. So you're going to put under the 25, and then we did this by 10 now. Thank you. We're going to have to do this differently. Because we thought we we're going to do them by 25s, but because we're doing them by 10s, I'm going to switch you. We had originally thought we were going to do packs of 25, and then we switched to packs of 10. I have a 10. Oh, you do. Okay. All right. So, as I grab a pack of 10 for Marsha, for a dollar, I just want you to put a tick mark in the 10, and then the next 10, the next 10, the next 10, okay? So, 10, another 10, another 10. Ten, six, seven, ten, eight, nine, nine, thirteen, fourteen. So that should be a hundred and forty, right? So that's the same, right? That's what we had. Now we're just going to go through the no votes. And everybody looked at these already, but I don't know if you want to look again. I'm just going to, yep, yeah, go ahead. So I'm just going to have you just tally at the bottom. I say a no vote, okay? Should this one just anywhere yeah. down below? You know, you tally four and then sure. the flash. Mm -hmm. But underneath so, all the squares, yeah. right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven. 12, Thirty-one. Thirty-one. Noble. 
So 147 plus 147 plus 31 should equal 325. We will seal these up and take a break. Okay. That's board night. Oh, yeah. I did not mention, but I'm going to mention for the notes that there were no provisionals for either ward. Okay. We're going to fill this out. So the seal used to secure this container is numbered 208. I can see, I'm sorry. Yes, 208 22. Nine seven. Can you repeat that? Please? Two zero eight mm -hmm. two two nine seven. Thank you. And then I'm just going to have you both sign at the bottom. Mind if I just look at the ballot? Which one do you want to look just at? The top. Oh, just this one. Look at the whole. Sure. Because there was that instruction thing missing, and I'm mm -hmm. just wanting to think of what I think I saw that. Thank you. You're welcome, Mayor. Do you have a used deal? Oops. But I don't, is this the one, did you take the ones for 20? I just, These are the ones for 20. Ones for 19. Where's the inspector statement for 19? It's right here. Right there. 208, 2337. So this is the seal that we broke off. I don't have a used seal. Like Yes, like that. Put that one in there with the ballot. Ballots in. Seal it off. Maybe just take a little here. All right, any questions before we break for a couple minutes? What time is it? It is 10.54. Okay, let's break for 10 minutes. Thank you. This conference will now be recorded. All right, everybody, we're going to start. Same process as last time. We will break at noon for lunch and then come back. And then um, I did just find out that we are participating in the tornado drill. So everybody that's here will go to the basement, except the board of canvassers will stay up here because if we have the ballots out, we don't want to leave the ballots out. The door should stay open. What time is that drill? One forty-five. So it'll be after lunch. <laughs> yes, it'll be after lunch. But yes. All right. So we're going to start with the same process, which means reconciling the poll books. I'm going to read a couple things first. Ward twenty for Alderperson, District ten. The original vote total was 579. Number of voters in the poll list was 579. And the number of absent. Can you, can you, I'm sorry. Slow down. Sure. Yep. The original votes, we had 579. Yeah. Okay. And the number from the poll list was 579. And the number of absentees in Ward 20 was 177. And there were zero rejected. Zero provisionals, if I don't forget to say that later. And that's all documented in the front of the poll book, correct? Yes. Yes. All right. So now we're going to go through line by line again and make sure our books match. Someone paying attention to your frames of interest. Oh, yes. <laughs> go ahead. Line one, 13 A. Line two, 12 A. Line four, 111. Line three, two, six, seven. Line four, two, six, six. Line seven, 14A. 
line 9, 15A, line 10, 276. Line 1, 275. Moving on to letter B. Line 5, 237. Line 6, 236. Line 7, 249. Line 1, 2, 1, 1. Line 2, 2, 10. Line 2, 2, 17. A, A, thank you. And line, line 5, 2, 5, 3. Line 6, 64. Okay. There's a problem. Okay. Line, line six, I have nothing, and then I have on line seven sixty four. Okay. So, so we went through these books yesterday just to identify any irregularities, and what we found was that there's two Thomas Bergens in the book. One is a four, and one is a five, and we actually ended up calling Mr. Thomas Bergen to make sure that he, because you couldn't tell by the signature because they're both. Thomas Bergens and the Thomas Bergen the fourth called back and did say he was the one that voted on election day. So the county book with voter number 64 for Thomas Bergen the fourth is the one that voted and they put 64 under Thomas Bergen the fifth in the city book. Which page is this on? On page seven. <laughs> Line 9, 218, line 10, A, yes, thank you, and line 10, 108. Okay, here's the paperwork There's from the, the paperwork to make sure Thomas Bergen. Yep. Line 3, 120, line 4, 121, line 6, 235, line 7, 281, Line eight two five seven A. Line five sixteen A. Line six seventeen A. Line eight eighteen A. Line nine one hundred eighty seven. Line ten nineteen A. Line number one twenty A. Line 2, 21A, and line 3, 22A. Line 1, 172. Line 6, 23A. Line 7, I mean line 8, I'm sorry, number 7. Line 2, 124. Line 5, 126. Line 8, 262 and line 9107. Line 7, 24 <coughs> A, line 8, 143, line 9, 142. Line 5, 212A. Line 2, 216, line 4, 241, line 7, 137, line 9, 130, line 10, 131. Letter C. Line 6, 188, line 7, 258A, and line 8. 25A. Line 2, 154. Line 3, 153. Line 6, 233. Line 10, 180. Line 1, 179. Line 3, 242. Line 5, 229. Line 9, 247. Line 3, 250. Line 1, 191. 
line 4, 160, line 10, 246. The letter D. Line 1, 176, line 2, 175, line 3, 26A, line 5, 29A, line 10, 125. Line 4, 30A, line 7, 139. Line 5, 228, line 6, 268, line 7, 31A. Line 2, 219A, line 5, 32A, line 6, 33A, line 7, 240. Line 8, 230. Line 9, 106. Line 1, 34A. Line 2, 35A. Line 2, 209. Line 3, 170. Line 4, 279. Line 5, 278. Line 9, 36A, line 10, 37A. Line 7, 136. Line 8, 135. Line 9, 4. Line 10 is 10. Line 2, 123. And line 6 is 6. Let's see. Letter E. Line 2, 38A, line 6, 39A, line 7, 150, line 9, 184, line 10, 40A, line 1, 159, line 2, 158, letter F, line 1, 41A, line 2, 213, line 3, 214, line 7, 42A, and line 10, 220A. Line 1, 221A, line 5, 9, line 6, 8, line 7, 43A, line 9, 166. Line 4, 52A, line 5, 116, line 6, 113, line 8, 112, line 9, 53A. And on uh, line 5, we have 186, and on line 7, we have 196. Is there discrepancy here? We have 196 on line six. So if you can see the signature, mm -hmm. whose signature is that? It's Susan Fredericks. So on page 36, mm -hmm. Susan Fredericks, voter number 196, is in the county book and signed the county book. However, stick in the city book, they put 196 under Elizabeth, Elizabeth Fredericks. Fredericks. And you can tell from the signature that it is Susan that voted. Mm -hmm. So the city book has the wrong number. So Elizabeth did not vote. Elizabeth did not vote. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And line one, 222A. G. Line one, 194. Line two. 118, line 3, 119, line 5, 105. Okay. Same thing, same thing happened here. Mm -hmm. Which page? So we are on page 39. 39. Mm -hmm. And well, Charles Gam. Charles, do you mm -hmm. look like his signature? Mm -hmm. You can read Charles Gam. Yeah. Is yeah. 105. Voter number 105 in the county book, sign the county book. And which, which line? Uh, line five. However, in the city book, they put it under line six. Erin 
scam, which did not, she did not vote. So Charles is the voter at 105. That should be it. Line number seven, 223A. Line number nine, 44A. Line 10, 147. Line 1, 45A. Line 3, 165. Line 4, 164. Line 5, 205. Line 6, 206. Line 7, 224A. And line number 8, 141. Line 1, 177. Line 2, 178. Line 7, 46A. Line 8, 140. Line 10, 199. Line 1, 27. Line 2, 28. And line 9, 171. Line 3, 259A. Line 5, 167, line 6, 157, line 8, 109. Line 1, 162, line 2, 47A, line 3, 48A, line 5, 49A, line 6, 50A, line 7, 238, line 8, 51A, and line 10, 3. Line 3, 204. Line 4, 203. And line 5, 225A. H. Line 2, 65A. Line 3, 66A. And line 10, 67A. Line 5, 145, line 1, 202, line 3, 68A, line 4, 207, line 7, 208, line 9, two, uh, excuse me, 70A, and line 10, 71A. Line 4, 190, Line 5, 189. Line 10, 134. Line 2, 72A. Line 3, 73A. And line 5, 74A. Line 4, 75A. Line 5, 54A. Line 7, 163 and line 10, 55A. Line 1, 56A. Line 3, 57A. Line 4, 185. Line 5, 58A. Line 7, 148. Line 8, 149. Line 9, 59A. Line 1, 265. Line 2, 264. Line 3, 2. Line 4, 169. Line 7, 244. And line 8, 243. Line 4, 201. Line 5, 200. Line 7, 127. Line 8, 5. Line 9, 272. Line 1, 60A. Line 2, 61A. Line 5, 62A. Line 6, 63A. Line 8, 144. Line 1, 193. Line 2, 76A. Line 3, 110. Line 7, 114. Line 8, 115. Other I. Line 1, 77A, and line 2, 78A. Letter J. Line 2, 79A. 
line 3, 80A, line 8, 183, line 3, 81A, line 4, 252, line 6, 251, line 7, 82A, line 8, 83A, Line 9, 84A. Line 2, 263. Line 8, 269. Line 10, 260. Line 1, 261. Line 2, 85A. Line 3, 86A. Letter K. Line 2, 161. Line 3, 174. Line 4, 173. Line 9, 117. Mm -hmm. Line 1, 87A. Line 6, 245. Line 7, 198. Line 8, 138. Line 2, 168. Line 5, 151. Line 6, 152. Line 7, 88A. Line 2, 239. Line 6, 155. Line 8, 156. Line 3, 271. Line 5, 89. Line 6, 102. Line 7, 231. Line 8, 232. <laughs> Full, full page. Oh, you have to say the lines if you don't want to on this page. Oh, I don't have to all say the lines. Up. So go right down. Oh, okay. 90A, 91A, 92A, 93A, 197, 182, 273, 274, 181, 226A. Line 1, 227A. Line 2, 94A. Line 6, line 6, 277. Line 2, 95A, and line 3, 96A. And L is line 2, 97A, line 3, 98A, line 4, 99A, line 6, 270, and line 10, 104. Line 1, 103, mm -hmm. line 2, 146, line 4, 256. Line 6, 69. Line 9, 139. Line 7. Line 132. I do also. I'm sorry I said one. That's okay. <laughs> line 5, 129. Line 9, 128. And line 10, 254. Line 8, 234. Line 1 is 248. Line 5 is 1, line 7 is 100A, and line 8 is 101A. Line 2 is 11. Line 1 is 133, line 2 is 122. And... Uh, let's see, Emily DePoctor is 192, Brian Adamovich is 195, Anna Fader is 215, um, Jennifer Davis 255, and Arkin Amnetti is 280. Ready, Martha? Yep. Yep. <laughs> Line 6, 179, line 9, 133, line 6, 105, line 7, 106, line 6, 278, line 7, 14A, line 10, 76, line 2, 15A, line 3, 16A, line 5, 80, line 8, 148, line 9, 291, line 10, 275, line 1, 276, 
line 3, 17a, line 4, 18a, line 8, 109, line 10, 108, line 3, 91, line 4, 92, line 7, 197a, line 8, 198a, uh, line 9, 104, line 2, 19a, line 3, 124, line 5, 139, line 7, 143, line 9, 149, line 1, 98, line 3, 99, line 5, 236, line, line 6, 271, 261. That one too, 261. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Line 220A, line 921A, line 10, 199A, line 2, 231, line 3, 200A, line 4, 262, line 5, 119, line 7, 100, line 10, 274, line 3, 214, line 4, 38, Line 6, 123, line 9, 5. And line 1, 167, line 2, 173, line 3, 174, line 4, 166, line 5, 97, line 6, 121, line 1, 161, line 2, 160, line 3, 233, Line 4, 201A, line 7, 101, line 8, 268, line 9, 22A. Line 2, 10, line 6, 183, line 10, 235. O. Line 4, 23A, line 7, 88. Line 1, 158, line 2, 110, line 4, 146. Line 5, 147, line 6, 279, line 2, 204A, line 3, 205A, line 4, 152, line 1, 181, line 2, 162, line 4, 194, line 8, 132, line 9, 114, Line 1, 193, line 4, 213, line 5, 87, line 7, 24A. Line 3, 169, line 8, 248, line 10, 25A. Line 5, 176, line 6, 175, line 7, 144, line 8, 145, line 10, 120. Line 126A, line 994. Oh, uh, Q, no Qs, R. Line 327A, line 4277, line 528A. Line 3192, line 5141, line 629A, line 8245, line 9239. Line 1, 247, line 2, 137, line 3, 134, line 9, two, nine 220, line 3,
This conference will now be recorded. This conference will now be recorded.
This conference will now be recorded.
Now we got to put them all together so we got to get the absentees up. But let's count. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Count the ballots and compare, separate the absentee ballots. So I'm going to separate you. You could watch. Just okay. make sure that we're. So we're just taking the ones out with the clerk's initials. Thank you. 
we wanted to show on the back end. Sure. Thank you.
and then I'll give them to you to go. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Getting old. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to. Yeah, can I have them? Yeah, the table here. All right, so we have two. Oh, wait, let's count these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one hundred, one hundred, one ten, one twenty, one thirty, one forty, one fifty, one sixty, one seventy. 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170. I have six here, and I have one absentee. That has my initials, and then somebody wrote Tammy's Taylor on it, which we know are not initials. How mm -hmm. do you, ladies, I don't know, if you want to come up, you can, whoever the representative can look at this too. This is an absentee ballot that was issued by me. Those are my initials. You can mm -hmm. see them all over. And then I don't know if they, somebody at home decided to add names to it. But as a, in what in what blank is her name listed? Is it an initials of election inspector? Yes. And is it, does it match the name of the person? We don't know that. We know it's an absentee. These are my initials. We know it's folded like an absentee. Does that? As, oh, go ahead. With that one, does it match the one seventy seven? Yes. It's one seventy six without this one. I'm saying it's an absentee. What is your vote? Do you vote that this is an absentee ballot yes. and some voter just mm -hmm. did that? Marsha? Mm -hmm. would, that's okay. I, I vote that's what happened. Okay. Would, you, would you have questioned it? If, in other words, would you have signed it if this was here already? No. So this has been added afterwards. Yes. By whom? Maybe the voter. Well, how would the voter have that <coughs> after you already initialed Because it? I initial it and send it in the mail. Got it. So when it was received, we don't know that until it goes to the polls on election day. That's and when it's open they open for it. The first time. Mm -hmm. So is this the first time anybody's seeing that I, it's well, on there, in a sense? I would not have. Yeah. I will not refute that. I mean, I, it's not yeah. my no. Okay. So the match, the match. So then it matches 177 to 177. We do have a ballot that only has one inspector's initials on it which it's required to have two. Yep. So I, the way I interpret the, the statute uh, under chapter nine is that at this point where, where you follow the process, there isn't a process at this point anymore for eliminating that ballot as long as the numbers match up. Okay. If the numbers didn't match up, okay. then, we, then there's a process. But okay. without that, it's, it's already happened, it's been counted, and uh, it's, it's a valid. It, additionally, I would say that when you go to voter intent, the, the initial problem isn't the voter's issue, it's the, it's the, it's the, sure. it's, right. it's inspectors. the inspector at that time. who made the failure, not the voter. Right. So okay. I would suggest that you count it. Count it. Okay. And, and especially the, since the, the inspector's the, initials go, or the ballot goes out or comes in? So this is not an absentee. I'm sorry. So the absentees match up. So this is part of the 502 that are left in that stack. And so they initial it at the table and hand it to the voter. So somebody Martha, didn't initial it. Right. Mm -hmm. So Martha and Chris, I'm I'm going to say to count this one. Mm -hmm. I will Do agree. agree. Do you agree? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any objection? Because the initials that are on there from the one look legit. Like I would, I would, I mean, we could compare it to another one, but yeah, I think that it's ones that I saw when I was sorting through, it just didn't get the second one. 
Okay, we'll put that on that stand. Okay, and now, well, these are actually supposed to be kind of like mixed in now. Can I have the big stack? So now we're going to sort. So we need those. So like sit to down. Do with these. Um, we're going to just put them kind of disperse them. Now we know that they match, so it doesn't matter anymore. So we're going to put some ballots in here. I have the 579. Thank you. <laughs> Is this where you're going to be doing the sorting? Yep. We're going to do you want to go in the middle? Can I stick this? Oh, yeah. So yeah. That looks and then I'll okay. sit in the middle. Well, you guys will be <laughs> again, and we'll just see yeah, out. Okay. Uh, yep, we'll sit right here. And then we'll... I think it was this time, this way last yeah, time. <laughs> yeah. Let's keep it in one way. Yes. All right. You see it? That's oh, God. Yeah. Okay. I'll be this way. Yeah. All right. We'll switch at some point. How's that? Yeah. <laughs> I can't remember. Do I look? Mm -hmm. Ladies, you just slow me down. Okay. Or let me know.
Yeah. yeah, I know. <clears throat> Mine are too, I tell you. <laughs> Lots of circles. Now in the directed register? Um, we, once we count them, okay. do you want to leave that one out? Um, leave that I one think in. it's questionable. I mean, yeah. I, I'm yeah. just saying that yeah. I'm not we sure. You can leave that one out. Yep, yeah. okay. absolutely.
that one. Well, I mean, but, I mean I'm not disputing I'm okay. them, but yep. if you want to do separate, it so yep. that at least we can look at them. Turn it, then I'm going to have to turn it back.
there's some yogurt bowl. Oh, that goes over there too, because that looks like it's yogurt bowl. Could be. <laughs> do, you, do you want to separate it that way? Yep. Those are just all the other ones we have to go through. Yeah, okay. we'll go through those. I don't think that's a vote for any either one. Okay. Which will be an inch. Well, be interesting when we get to it. I don't see any marks in any other. As far as these go, yeah. would it make sense for us to make judgment on that before it becomes a one or two point uh, vote difference? I mean, in terms of just let's make a decision on these. I mean, uh, otherwise you make a decision based upon, you know, what the rest of it looks like. Don't we have well, I mean, we would count them as there's questions with like if the machine would have read these. So right. we make the decision, but leave them off into the side because they might think, be objected to. What is? Yeah, I think you need to you need to make a decision right. at, at this point. Okay. And then let them object to it if, if you want, and then place them in the to, to be counted. Then at that point. Okay. <coughs> so. Can we look at them individually? Yes. Well, let's. We're going to make our decision first. Okay. So there are three. One has a line through. One has a little bit of a scribble, and one has an X. Ladies, I... Okay, so we're going to vote on this. Um, I say it's a vote for Joe. I do, too. Mm -hmm. When she read that. Yeah. I say it's a vote for... Is that first one... Has a line through it. I'm saying it's a vote for Joe. I'm saying this is a vote for Joe, too. Our machines are supposed to be sensitive and pick up if there is something in there. And there um, is nothing in the other. And there's nothing in the other boxes. Right. So you, to me, I'm voting that it is. Do you want us to um, object singularly? Okay, yeah, yes. that's what I was doing. Okay, yes. Or do you want us yep. to just, nope, you're going to vote first? Absolutely. We vote that this one is a vote for Joe. Okay. Let's just turn around so you guys see. Yeah. Okay. No, I don't know. This one's a hard one. Yeah, this is a hard one. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm. I don't have any objection on that. So are we? And this is the one that. What the machine reads or voter intent? You're determined. You're determining voter intent. Not what the machine yeah. would read. Okay. And on this well, this then. this ballot you're saying is a vote for Joe. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Gotcha. If we are doing voter intent. <clears throat> I'm going to vote that this is not a vote for Joe. I would agree because they're they're yes. totally filled in, and that looks like a pen might have yes. just brushed it, decided. It so if we're doing voter intent, I vote no vote. I agree. Can I take a look at that? Yep. Then? Is this the scribble one? This is the very light. It's just one. a tiny a little. Bit. Well, I guess my question is, what are the odds? What are the odds that this person? Ran out of ink. Well, oh, no. yeah, I mean, what are the odds that that person didn't vote for Joe when the mark is clearly inside the circle and there's no mark anywhere else 
on the page, any other mark like it. Like in other words, even a mark over here, over there, over there, it happens to be in his circle. And it is clearly a mark. I would agree it's not consistent with these two, but it's the only other mark on the entire page. Why what were the odds that they would happen to be in his circle and in the inside of it? And there's no other mark on the entire page. Well, I also would just note that there this is not the that there are several other um, instances where the person where the voter was to vote and didn't vote on this ballot. It's not like this was the only one. So I think that it's consistent with a no vote. To me, it feels like the person was using their pen to like read along and touched that because if you look on the back too, fully filled in. You know, mm -hmm. they knew what they were doing. So on our I vote board of canvassers mm -hmm. and you can object to that. Either party can object to that. But yeah, I, I would object to, okay. that, to the ruling on this one. Okay. So Chuck, do we just set that one aside? Set that one aside. And this one Go that we on. all agreed and there was no objection to is going in Joe's pocket. Correct. And then there's one more that has an X. And it's consistently X's throughout the whole ballot. Mm -hmm. And I vote that it's a vote for Joe. I do too. Yes. Rita, if there's any objections to that one. Yeah. Okay. All right. No objections. No objections for that one. These are the no votes. These are the Joe votes. All right. Oh, and you still have to go through all the. <coughs> but we might wait because there's going to be a tornado drill. Yeah, excellent. and we are going to sit. The board of canvassers will sit diligently with the ballots. Yeah. So if anybody wants to take a five-minute break until the tornado drill, everybody has to leave the room and go in the basement during the tornado. Drill. There's no other, yes, except for us. No, nope. the board of canvassers is going down with the ship. <laughs> if a tornado comes, we're going down with it. So if anybody wants to, we're going to um, recess right now until after the tornado. Are you going to stay here? You can go outside. Yes. What if I want to stay here? Oh, they canceled it. Okay, well, thank okay. you for letting oh, me know. Oh, yeah. oh. Does anybody, do you need to use the restroom okay. before we start? Yeah, I, I could do it. Okay, we'll take a five minute break anyway to go to the bathroom and get a drink. Yeah. And then we'll start counting. Oh, yeah. So, to me, look at the no, no, that was the statute of voter intent talks about any other marks, right? That's there's no different. I mean, right, that's the nice thing. There's nothing else. Square, nothing there. Right, but you're certainly not in The machine wouldn't pick it up. The machine picks up my stuff. This conference will now be recorded. Yeah, you're right. It's like, it, you're right. They, they pull like real nice. You're right. Okay. All right. So we're ready. We're going to have Martha take Joe's on that end and start putting in bunches of 10, please. And have you just all moved this stuff? You can start. Okay. This ballot we're going to put down here and it to. Okay.
We don't hear the sign. I didn't hear it. Sorry, I'm so I'm sorry. Oh, Chris. <laughs> oh, you're fine. Switch. Yeah. All right. You could each count each other's stacks. Please.
I give up. The finger hates me. Oh. <laughs> 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 Oh, <laughs> All right, do we need a pen for Chris? Right? Probably put over the All right, so these are in tens. And because there's more ballots in the other one, it's going to go to the second page. Okay. The second page is just so when we get up to that point, because there's only 200 on the tally. All right, okay. so we'll start. Mark up. We have 10. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, Ready? Ten. 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 Ten, 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 and four. Two sixty-four. Two sixty-four. Okay, that's what we should have. That's what the canvas said. So the objected to ballot, and she did not count as a vote for Joe. Is what that's telling me. Excuse me, you yes. for Joe. Two sixty-four. Okay. The tapes at 264 versus 260, where did that extra one then come from? That was counted for no one. That was a no vote. Okay. So it had so a little smudge. Really the machine did not count it not for Joe is what that's what this is telling us right yeah. now, that that was the no okay. vote. Got it. So now we'll go through, if anybody wants to look at these, these are the no votes. And I'll come, let's see, well, we'll just do it in the middle here. All right, so we'll put them in packs of 10. Oh, I'm sorry. For the, just, can everybody see? Well, no, anybody can see while we do this. All right, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Thank you. 
it. Was it 53? Mm -hmm. Pardon me? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep. Yeah. 260 plus 264 plus 53 plus 1. But you have the one over there. Thank you. <laughs> plus 1. Mm -hmm. 279. Someone put it in the machine when it has said overvote. This one? Yeah. Yes, it should yeah. have said an overvote. Yes. Did, did it do that? Um, where are the tickets? They were on it? The voters should have Right. It should have said overvote. Yeah. And they could have taken it back. Mm -hmm. There were more 20, right? Mm hmm. Or 20, the older person said this one had one overvote on this machine. Yep. Mm -hmm. And this one had zero overvotes. So, so this is probably the overvote. The one overvote. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, yeah. good. Mm -hmm. And would that person who made that vote be given a new ballot then to complete? If they wanted to. Right. Mm -hmm. They decided not to. They didn't care. So does does the machine kick it out or make it a noise? It should. It does yes. make a noise. It does make a noise. Mm -hmm. So we don't know whether the the voting people said you can do it or you need to do another ballot or they would have because you either you have to press a button. So on the machine it won't let you do anything. So once it goes in, it'll say there's an overvote for this category. And then what is you the button either, choices? You can submit it as is or you can return it. So you could even return it, have the voter look at what the contest was. If they said, well, yeah, I don't really care, you know, that I overvoted in that one, I want the other votes to count. It has to go in the machine because it got a number in the poll book. If for some reason they said, I, oops, I made a mistake, I really do want to correct that. Then that's the time they'd go back to the poll book table and there's a process to get a new ballot. Um, but at this venture, I would say more likely than not, they said, I. I'm good with, with the rest of the ballots. Yeah. This one is the I'll bet you it's the same guy who did the dot in that one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope not because that's. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Huh. So can we, we need to add up the oh, sheets. Yeah, exactly. You know, absentee. Yeah. And someone would realize they did it. Right. They validated yeah. it. But so that would be their 19. Them. That's 20. Let's see that one more time. Sure. We, we put them in the other room. Okay, yep. Okay. All right. So are there any objections to any ballots before I put them and seal them up? What do we do with the objection that's still sitting out there? Well, it remains an objection, so I okay. guess it's up to the objector if they want to withdraw it or they want to maintain it. I will withdraw because I thought it had been counted, so no, it's not. I'm okay. I will not. Okay. Just, then it's a, the, the objection is withdrawn. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm withdrawn for this ballot. Okay, this one. And that one's going to go in. Okay. 
All right. So then we'll just add up the totals for each. And so you each have your tally sheets. So then we'll add up Reinthaler first, which is 147 plus 260, which equals 407. And Heidemann, we have 147 plus 64, which equals 411. So it's the same number that the canvas got. So with the, it remains the same as Heidemann is the winner for District 10. We will lock up this. Let's table these together. We're going to table these together. Let's lock it up before we adjourn. We'll have to fill that out in just a second. Okay, let's put these in there. <laughs> we have the 101 for this. Ah, or did we? It was here. This is not in your She's going to have to sign something indicating that. That's true. She'll have to pay. Joe, we need you. I know, Marsha. Yes. Yes, it was here. So it's always So the seal number, ladies. Somebody's writing down. Can we ask Joe? We're still in session, so please keep it down. Thank you. I need to Number one, we're number two, one. Two, three, two, five. One more. Two, three, two, five. Thanks. Okay. All right. Okay. Signing document. So then I will sign now. Yeah. Nope. Nope. No official. Yep, we're all done. Yep. You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh, the eleven. What? It came out the way it did originally. It did. Absolutely. Oh, shoot. We're going to give it to John. Yeah, we'll just give it to John and see it didn't get. All right. So then this one. No, I Held on April second, twenty twenty four. So we're just gonna sign this as part of the recount. Dated April. Um, 2024. All right, so if you would all sign that, I'd appreciate it. Can you do it? Yeah, thank you so much. Okay, before I seal the ballot. Okay, we're going to have everything and we'll close it in here. So, okay. All right, we stand adjourned at 215. Yep, yep, 2.15.